Hello everyone and welcome to Fletcher Farms Amarillo. I'm Julie Fletcher. We are working on our first rescue mission for 2024. We're working to rescue uh, two mares and a gelding. Uh, we need your support on this one because we weren't planning on rescuing uh, any more horses and definitely not right now. Um, but these horses definitely need help. One was a direct ship. Um, she looks to be in pretty bad shape. She's blind in one eye. And then there's another gelding who looks to also be in pretty bad shape as well. So uh, these are the horses that we're looking to rescue as of right now. Six with the Bowie Texas livestock is going to be a fancy 15 Duhan Belgian mare. She's stocky made, she's 17 years of age. She's clean legged. Uh, they've just pulled a foal off her. They've uh, said that they've had several foals over the last few years and they pulled another foal off her recently. She is a little bit more bigger of a bag on her. She is shapy. She's not been worked in a few years, so you will have to get her uh, reworked if you'd like to drive her or ride her. It'll take a uh, little bit of practice to get her back into the swing of it. But uh, really nice horse. Very well put together, lots of shape to her, and acts extremely nice. Now, if you're interested in her and need her price, go to our website, that's BowieTexasLivestock.com. If you click Auto Wire Horses, you will see her listed on there. Transport is available. Main routes are California, Kentucky, North Carolina, Michigan, and Florida. This is the first mare that we are looking at rescuing. She seems to be in pretty decent condition and it looks to be relatively healthy. Obviously, we don't ever know what condition they're going to actually be in until we get there to pick them up, but she does look from this video to be in relatively good condition and looks like she's moving out clean. As you can see, she moves out nice. Her feet are a little small. They need some shoes on her. A little shape up would be good, but super nice mare. She's been well taken care of. She's in good condition. If someone's looking for a nice one, once again, her tag number is 1896. She's with BowieTexasLifestock.com. Number 1973 with the Bowie Texas Livestock is a sorrow Belgian gelding. He's 17 one. He's 14 years of age. He's a big, gentle giant right here. We had about six or so of these Belgians that came in. They're just big, quiet, gentle. They've all been used on Namish farm. They're all quiet, they're all easy going. Now they've been used for pulling wagons. They allow you to jump up on them. They're quiet, they're easy going. If you want to trail ride them, you will take a little bit more work as far as trail riding would work, as far as saddling up, etc. But he is extremely quiet. As he mentioned, there were five other horses that came in with him, and he is the last horse that did not get rescued or saved. He does look to be in pretty rough condition. He looks like he has something going on with his back left leg, so we will need to get him medical attention as soon as possible. But he seems to be super sweet and super gentle, and there's no way that we wanted to. We don't want this guy to go to slaughter, so we definitely need your help and your support to try to get this guy saved and get him the medical attention that he needs and give him the retirement he deserves. You can see he's just big, he's quiet, he's gentle. His tag number once again, 1973. You can see him trotting there, he's going to be off of that back left leg. He's with BowieTexasLivestock.com. Click on wire horses. You'll see him listed on there. 2020 with the Bowie Texas livestock is going to be a Belgian mare. 16 hands, she's about 22 years of age and very, very gentle and quiet. She does not have any vision on the right side. And you can see her back is quite a bit lower. This mare is going to be direct ship. She will ship over the next couple of days to Mexico. When I saw this beautiful mare posted on their website and saw the condition that she was in, it absolutely broke my heart and brought tears to my eyes. No animal deserves to be treated like this. She's in desperate need of some medical attention. She looks to have some issues maybe with her hips. 
The sway back could also be a genetic condition, so we won't know until we can rescue her and get her to the vet. She is on the direct shipped list, which means that she will ship to slaughter over the next couple days if we can't get her saved and rescued. So we desperately need your support in saving these three horses and giving them the retirement they deserve. If you can help support us in any way, we would truly appreciate it in rescuing these three horses. All the information for the fundraiser is at thebighooffoundation.org. We need to cover their bail and also transport. We are going to go pick them up, but we need your help um, with their bail and their transport. Uh, eventually we will do another fundraiser for their medical because they are going to need medical attention. But as of right now, we don't know what they're gonna need. So um, if you can support us in any way, we would truly appreciate it. And uh, we hope that we can rescue these three horses and bring them home to Fletcher Farms Amarillo and uh, the Big Hoof Foundation. And I also wanted to say thank you all so much for all of your support for our last fundraiser. We truly appreciate it and all the kind words for Aurora. We truly appreciate that as well. Uh, sometimes I can't get to all the comments, but I do try to read mostly all of them. And I know Corey reads every single comment that comes through on our YouTube channel. So again, thank you all so much for the kind words and support. We do truly appreciate every single one of you. And we also appreciate everyone that watches our videos. Thank you to everybody that has supported us in all of our fundraisers. Without your support, we wouldn't be able to be rescuing all of these horses. So thank you again to everyone that has supported us. And again, we really can't, we couldn't do this without you. So again, thank you all so much for your support. Stay tuned. We'll have more updates coming soon.